Right everyone, so as you may have heard through my Discord, through my Instagram, etc, that the other day I almost got stuck in a lift in a Otis Gen 2 in a TK Maxx in Leeds City Centre. So Alex, so I'm going to explain what happened. So, called the lift from the top level as normal. Um, the doors opened, got into it, went down to the bottom level, which is, um, yeah, floor zero, because I think it's like one, zero, minus one. Actually, it's one, zero, minus one. So it went from one, the lift stopped on zero. Some people came in because they were going down as well. The lift went down to the bottom level. But when it got down to the bottom level, the inner doors opened ever so slightly and the rest of the door, the rest of the doors did not open. So I'm presuming there was a mechanical fault with the outer doors, which I didn't know about at the time um, until, I, um, um, until I checked the lift again. So, so then when that happened, I thought for a moment, I thought, oh shit, am I stuck in the lift? So I tried door open, the doors wouldn't open. Tried all the other floors, it wouldn't work. And I thought, oh no, am I stuck in here? And I thought for like about 5, 10 seconds, or 15 seconds even, that I was stuck in the lift for the first time in my entire life. But the lift doors did close in eventually and the lift did start moving. And I've had a lot of near misses when it comes to lifts. Funny enough, I have never been stuck in one yet. But it will happen one day and it's just a matter of when it's going to happen, so... But anyway, the lift, at least the lift did start moving. And then I, then I got out on the above level because I didn't really want to risk it. But then, a few minutes later, the, the doors did actually open on the lower level. I'm like, how's that possible? So I presumed it was a mechanical fault, fault or something. Where it wasn't, where those lower doors were not maintained properly. The outer doors on floor minus one. So the inner door safety must have disconnected as the doors were opening down there. Because obviously the lift can't move if the doors are not shut properly. And it's the same if the lift was moving and the doors, like, if the safety circuit was disconnected or the doors were pulled when the lift was moving, the lift would immediately stop as a safety precaution. Which lifts need to do that, really, because anyone could just pull it and then it would stop the lift. But I would strongly, you know, not recommend doing that as you can, you know, wear out the brakes and stuff. On the lift and cause wear so I'll... but at least i didn't get stuck but that was yet again another close cl close call of me you know almost getting stuck in the lift again it's happened several times but luckily so far i've never been stuck in one i have a feeling it will happen at some point it will happen someday but the question is when is the massive questions i keep saying to everyone so I thought I'd share that little story uh, with you guys. Obviously, I wasn't able to film it because obviously there was other people inside the lift. So, so that's pretty much the full story. So, and one more thing I'm going to mention while I'm on here is I am now, for those of you who follow my YouTube, I am almost at 284 subscribers on my Lift Inspector YouTube channel, my main channel. I'm a I'm up to 284. If we can get it to 300 subscribers, I'll I might think about putting together a compilation for you guys of something. Or I might do a fan submitted one. So feel free if you got any ideas for this, feel free to let me know in in the comments down below and I'll see what I can do. And with LI Plus, I'm up to 114 now and and I just wanted to say thanks so much for your continued support to both YouTube channels and a special shout out to Yoshi's Productions and Carolina Elevators in EAS for their fantastic support in the Discord server and the server boosts, which is hugely appreciated. And to everyone else who is supporting me along this journey. So with that said, I think that's going to be it. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.